talk about cognitive behavior therapy, cognitive distortion, and uh, this aspect of my art, which is a direct correlation to all of the CMY that you see me in front of. In Taoism, the energy that we have the most of, the most, is called Jing, J-I-N-G. Jing, like that. We're gonna start singing. A lot of this has to do with some really fucked up shit <laughs> at the pagoda of nine. There's a there's a very important actual crossing because we're a fucking tensegrity structure, neuroscience. <laughs> anyway, that's why we're fucked up. Okay, so, uh, and it's all white people's problems because we don't believe in lineage or nothing. Uh, so this is why white people need to speak to me about the importance of human. That'll get you into this aspect. This is the, sa the sack of balls, the balls we're gonna be hitting. This is the, um, anything that is axial and spiral in the body. And this maps to chi of the three treasures of Tao. Uh, this is also the one thing that I have never paid attention to, like practically, because you actually have to do shit. Like this is where feng shui happens, okay? You have to actually, you have to like measure stuff and like look at things, Blech. But now I'm an expert at that, so I can help you with that. Uh, this is also though where we heal the inner child. So this is where all of the magenta is in what you're seeing me in front of. I have invoked Millennium Falcon and we're gonna, I think it's gonna be like a Millennium Falcon amygdala thing because what we want to end up being reflected in because alchemy is about reflection and refraction, humans of, <laughs> what is this thing? The um, Darla, the law of attraction. Yeah, that's why y'all are becoming Nazis. You don't understand alchemy um, or perspective, which brings us to the psycho of the biopsychosocial model. And I'm stoked as fuck at doing this without a uh, script, so. This is, I have spent quite some time actually um, getting this together in large part because not a single human, not a single human, <laughs> no. Um, I am very much in IFS terminology, experiencing exile. Uh, I also declared myself a Taoist master not very long ago and people thought I was ridiculous about it, but I don't know. So let's talk about the psycho of the biopsychosocial model. This is the meme factor, M-E-M-E. -E. This correlates to Shen in TCM, and Shen are the magical mysticals. They're the magical mysticals. Yeah, magical mysticals. We have to call them magical mysticals because this needs to be able to operate for anybody of any faith, regardless, okay? Magical mysticals. And we're gonna call them Shen because that's accurate to what this is, which is some kind of intergalactic Chinese medicine rooted in ethos. So that's me. And what I am positioning myself here is as like net zero. My role in all of this is to disappear, perceptually. The, the design uh, work term for it is elegant design. And I learned that with Edward Tufte when he was teaching me about propaganda and why it's bad. I have direct big data mapping to everything on this side, um, especially as it relates to logistics and movement and humans. And this is where the 911 emergency services piece fits in and where I think that I'll be probably just connecting directly through my friend at the Economic Policy Institute, who I've known since I was 13. So this is where all the sexy fun time stuff happens. I may or may not be involved. Do you see? 
I have made this operate and function so that I do not need to be in the middle of it. This is one of the ways that we uh, decolonize. Anyway, uh, so this is the thing that's getting all of the skinny white yoga chicks really messed up. My best way to define it right now is meme. Um, but I haven't, I have to actually like call somebody now. I have to call it fucking Edward Tufty or, um, oh, they'll let me know later. See ya.